Navigating the Heart Who is Dragging You? by Ok Su Park Chapter 1 Heart Like a river, there is a way the heart flows. There are many people who try to overcome addictions like playing video games or those who try to quit drinking and smoking. They try with all their strength and determination, but for the most part, they end up quitting in the middle. This is due to the fact that they do not know precisely about the world of the heart. Change in life does not come from determination and labor. It is the heart that must first be changed because like a river, there is a way the heart flows. At this restaurant, I really feel like I am eating at home. There is a college student dance team called the Righteous Stars. Last year, they received the grand prize in the two largest national dance competitions in Korea, the Andong Dance Competition and the Chonan Dance Competition. They have also received prizes at other various street festivals. At the Cheonan Hyung Taryung Dance Festival, the MC said, We have looked into the reason why the righteous stars are good at dancing, and we came to this conclusion. The other teams just dance, but the righteous stars dance joyfully. No matter how hard a person works, nothing can be compared with working joyfully. When we do things joyfully, the results are so much greater. Even when we think about quitting drugs, quitting with a hopeful, joyful heart versus quitting with our efforts and labour are vastly different. Even in a shoe store, you cannot compare just selling shoes with selling shoes with a joyful heart. If you come to know the world of the heart, it is more than, oh, I should study hard, I should work hard. Now you are able to do everything joyfully, and have fun. There is a married couple I know that runs a restaurant in America and they do it with such joy in their hearts. Their children are all married and so it is just the two of them that live together. As they see the people of the neighborhood happily eating, they are satisfied. They don't have the ambition to make lots of money. When customers come, they talk with them and when they see that the food is not enough, they give them larger portions. When the customers come to this restaurant, the heart of joy is transferred. People say to themselves, when I eat at this restaurant, it really feels like I am eating in my own home. Everyone who comes to this restaurant has the same sentiment. So there are frequent customers and the restaurant is doing quite well. With such a restaurant in existence, who wouldn't go there often? A person who works with making money as their primary goal will have the heart to decrease the costs of the ingredients more and more in order to gain more profit. After a while, the food portions decrease and the ingredients become less fresh. When the customers discover this, they no longer go to that restaurant. No matter what it may be, if you do anything for your own selfish gain, this will be the outcome. Even regarding your personal studies, if you study for your own personal gain, competition becomes fierce and relationships become difficult and superficial. If this occurs, there are many things that are lost in your heart. Sure. If you are highly educated or extremely skilled in a particular area, you might make lots of money. But if you know the world of the heart, you could become so much happier. As a result, there would be no problems between husbands and wives. There would be no need to receive mental treatment and there would be no need to think about suicide.